let's set up our Revit model. First, you're gonna have your schedule. So as you can see, uh, something similar to this. Um, I prefer that you guys do it in Microsoft Project. Save your schedule as a CSV so that we can tr uh, ex import it into Navsworks. Make sure you've got a task ID column. That's very important because that basically forms your link to your Revit model. Now, to set up your Revit model, we've got to create shared parameters. So click on shared parameters. Let's add a new group, call it 4D Sim simulation. And then under that group, we'll add a parameter, task ID, that would be your text. Once that is created, we gotta load it into our project. Now, given that I've already done that before, I've got an old task ID which I wanna remove. So that is from the previous run. Now let's add the new one, click on shared parameter, select the new task ID parameter. Um, then make sure it's an instance, check all so that you include it into all categories. Click OK, and now once you click on a on the floor, you see that there's a task ID. Now copy that task ID from your schedule into this field. And do the same for the other uh, components. So for my schedule, that is 150. 151 for the second wall. And then the last four, that's 152. Now I want to select my windows, so just like I showed you last week, filter, check none, and then select your windows. Now that they're all highlighted, you can add a task ID associated with all windows 610. So it's as simple as that.